First, take out of all items from the package. Package includes backup camera, 23.5 feet RCA video cable, power cord, red T taps, screws, user manual. Install the camera using the cardboard demo. Use cardboard to demonstrate the proper location of the camera on the car. Take out the screw. Pass the spacer through one end of the camera first. Then pass the circular ring through. Finally put the screw through the end of the camera. Follow my operation. After adjusting the angle of the camera, tighten the screws. Follow my operation. Connect the extension cable to the camera. Pick up the video cable. Connect one end of the video cable to the RCA connector on the camera. Connect the other end of the video cable to the RCA connector on the head unit monitor. Connect the power cable to the DC connector on the camera extension cable. The red wire is connected to the positive pole of the reversing lights, tail lights, and license plate lights. The black wire is connected to the ground of the reversing light, tail light, and license plate light. The image appear on the screen. There are two thin red wires, trigger wires, on the video cable. If your head unit has a trigger cable, please connect the trigger cable to the red trigger wire of the RCA video cable and connect the red trigger cable at the other end to the positive wire of the backup light license plate light. There are three thin wires on the extension cable of the camera. Use a tool to cut the thin white wire. Turn off the camera's power and quickly turn on. The image automatically switches to normal mode. Now the guideline appear on the screen. Use a tool to cut the thin green wire. Turn off the camera's power and quickly turn on. The guideline not appear on the screen. Use a tool to cut the thin blue wire. Turn off the camera's power and quickly turn on. The image automatically switches to vertical normal mode. If you want the image to be in mirror mode, you can merge the cut thin white wires. Use a tool to cut off the rubber outside the thin white wire. Please be careful not to cut the copper wire inside. Merge the cut white thin wires. After merging, wrap the exposed copper wire tightly with insulating tape. Follow my operation. Turn off the camera's power and quickly turn on. The image automatically switches to mirror mode. The same method can be used for the green thin line and the blue thin line.
The process of connecting the camera to the lamp line. T-taps. T-taps has two holes and one hole is closed. The long line is the line of the lamp or the circuit line on the car. Thrust the car light line into the first hole. camera power cord. Plug the power cord into the second hole. Iron sheets. Clamp the iron sheet to the tap's bottom.